Hello, I'm so happy to see you again. You back to back we're years. Back. Yes, you yes. were here last year to talk about the sure. toast of Black Hollywood. Yes. Talk to us about the event this weekend. Yeah, we're back again. I can't believe how quickly the year happens. And Toast of Black Hollywood, we're bigger and better than ever. We're still um, uh, celebrating incredible accomplishments with our peers and our loved ones and those just really making a mark in culture. And we have such a great list this year too, just like last year, I'm super excited. Can you talk about the list? Yes, okay. please, oh my <laughs> gosh. I have some of my best friends also in the business, but also they're just killing it in the world. We have Tristan Wilds, Mac, he's an incredible actor, actor Malcolm Mays. Um, we have Scott Evans, Cam Amy Crawford from MTV's Catfish, which okay. I freaking love that yes. show. Yes. Lorianne Gibson, she is a legend in this game, deserves her flowers. Uh, breast cancer survivor and Housewives of Miami star Gertie, she's my dear friend. I wanted to make sure she felt loved on. I mean, she kicked cancer's butt this mm. last year, and so wanted to have her. Oh, she's a, sh she's a shiro. A she's a shiro. Yeah, for sure. And so we have so many more. Brian Javar, he's, he's from Los Angeles, like myself from Compton, and he's just making waves, being one of the the biggest celebrity um, stylist ever and so yeah it's gonna be great I love that you mentioned that you're from Compton yes. you got to recognize the roots always why is this and by the way we were showing past events that's yes. what we were seeing there beautiful yes. venue Thank why you. is this so important to do I think it's important because every year I'm, I'm bogged down with like work but everybody is like you have to do it it's so important to us there's people that maybe you're not even able to get an email back from but you get in the room and now you're able to do business you mm -hmm. know I people that come to me and say I got a job because I went to your event and I spoke to so-and-so and so for me it's about continuously always doing community work always doing something that's impactful and being able to bring us together and showcase how great we're doing in this in this business I mean you just touched on it but clearly this does make a significant difference yeah. in someone's lives just by it becomes a networking event it and literally has the power to change your life has the power to, and I've and it's happened and so many people come to me and tell me that and that's what I'm, I'm most proud about. Uh, so the list has already been curated. Yes. So this isn't like this is a public event. No. But it's very, <laughs> we all wish we could go. Uh, but it's just important to get the word out and sure. to celebrate uh, the toast to Black, Black Hollywood. Hollywood. Yeah. It's, okay. It, it really is. And it used to be called a toast to Young Hollywood. But I wanted to showcase in particular Black excellence, all Black and Brown um, um, ethnicities, but really just the Black excellence. We went through a lot during 2020, and so I wanted to be able to make sure the world sees us in a really great light as well. I love it. Well, we just saw a picture with you and Nick Cannon, and then Jason Derulo. He was on Good Day LA recently, oh, he's so he my was different. sitting. He was sitting right there. So now you're here, and yes. that's what's important. <laughs> all right, uh, congratulations on all Thank the wonderful you. work you do. Have a wonderful event, a taste yes. to Black Hollywood coming up this weekend ahead yes. of the BET Awards. Yes. Candace Grace, thank you so much. Okay.